A certain freezing process requires that room temperature be lowered from 40 degrees Celsius at the rate of 5 degrees Celsius every hour. What will be the room temperature 10 hours after the process begins? It's saying that some at some initial stage, your room's temperature is 40 degrees Celsius. It's 40 degrees Celsius. And once you start some certain freezing process or certain freezing system is switched on, so at the end of every one hour, that is by every one hour, your room's temperature will be lowered by five degrees Celsius. That's what rate is. Rate is that after every one hour, your room's temperature will be lowered by five degrees Celsius. It's asking that what will be the room's temperature after 10 hours? What will be the room temperature after 10 hours? So it's simple. Let me explain you like this. Suppose this 40 degrees Celsius and this is your initial stage when your temperature was 40 degrees Celsius. 40 degrees Celsius. At this initial stage, it was 40 degree. After one hour, after one hour, one hour, your temperature will be lowered by 5 degrees Celsius, right? It, it's lowered by 5 degree. After another one hour, after another one hour, after another one hour, so suppose the next stage was here, right? So after another one hour, it will again be lowered by 5 degrees Celsius. It will again be lowered by 5 degrees Celsius. After another one hour, if you take this as a stage, after another one hour, it will again be lowered by 5 degrees Celsius. So 5 degree, 5 degree, 5 degree. That's what it's asking that what will be the room's temperature after 10 degree, after 10 hours. So after one hour, it was 5 degree. So someone say that, okay, what will be the total drop in temperature after two, two hours? That is from here to here. This is one hour, this is one hour, that is two hours. Two hours. So someone may ask that, what's the total drop in temperature after two hours? So you will say that, okay, five plus five, right? So that's what, after two hours, it will be two times five. Why? Because five plus five. For one hour five, for another one hour five, that's for two times five. So someone will ask, okay, what will be after three hours from the initial stage? So you will say that after three hours, it will be from here. What will be the total drop? The drop will be from here to here. That is one hour plus one hour plus one hour. That is three hours. That is three hours. And what's it for every one hour? That is drop is of five hours of five degree. So this drop will be 15 degree from the initial stage and in this case it was 10 degree how this 5 plus 5 in this case 5 plus 5 plus 5 that is 15 so someone may ask that okay what will be the drop in temperature from the initial stage total drop in temperature from the initial stage after four hours after four hours So you will say that okay after four hours it will be like in this case here another five degree degree Celsius temperature drop after one hour. So for four hours it will be one hour plus one hour plus one hour plus one hour that is four hours five plus five plus five plus five and therefore four times let me take with this color for four hour it will be four times five. That is 20 degrees Celsius. That is a temperature drop. This is telling you temperature drop. This five degree was temperature drop. This again, temperature drop. This again, a temperature drop. So after two, one hour, your temperature drop will be five degree. After two hours, your temperature drop will be 10 degrees. After three hours, your temperature drop will be 15 degrees. After four hours, your temperature drop will be 20 degrees. So by the end of 10 hours, how much will be temperature get dropped? So if you 
follow the same pattern that is for the second two hours it's two times like for the first hour it was one times five that is five degrees celsius temperature drop for the two hours it will be two times five that is 10 degrees celsius after three hours it will be three times five that is 15 degrees celsius drop after four hours the temperature drop will be 20 degrees celsius temperature drop going by this pattern after 10 hours the temperature the total temperature drop will be 50 degrees celsius 50 degrees celsius now notice these are the temperature drop that is by this amount our temperature has dropped but this is not telling the room temperature it's telling the how, by how much by what value our temp room's temperature has dropped so this is dropped by 50 degrees celsius so your initial temperature was 40 degrees celsius after 10 hours your room temperature has dropped by 50 degrees celsius so someone will say us okay then what's the room temperature if it has dropped by 50 degrees celsius then what's the room temperature you will say that the room temperature will be since it it was initially it was 40 degrees celsius now our temperature has dropped from 40 to by 50 degrees celsius it has dropped by 50 degrees celsius so this will be minus 10 degrees celsius will be the my room temperature so whatever freezing, freezing system we have used it is uh, dropping temperature by 5 degrees celsius after every one hour so by the end of 10 hours the temperature dropped in the room will be 50 degrees celsius therefore the room temperature will be 40 that was initial dropped by 50 that is it has dropped by 50 by after 10 hours therefore my room temperature is now 10 degrees celsius